Hello and welcome to Vocabulary Wednesdays and I am Chris with Magoosh and today the theme is words that are about words. That is words that relate to other words. And what does that actually mean? Well, let me give you an example. Let's start off here with a bodderize. Now this is an odd looking word. It's actually known as an eponym and an eponym is a word taken from somebody's name. Now, who was this Mr. Bowdler? Well, he was a well-intentioned 19th century gentleman who wanted to bring Shakespeare into the homes of all. That includes women and children. Now, that sounds like a pretty innocuous endeavor. However, Shakespeare was known for quite a filthy tongue. He was sort of the potty humorist of the 16th century. So, Bowdler came around and censored or got rid of all the offensive or objectionable material in Shakespeare. And today, we have this word bodlerize, and it means to get rid of words that are deemed objectionable. So when I said words on words, it's a word about words. In this case, it's a word meaning blotting out or putting black over the bad words. Next, we have apothem. Fun word, you don't really see that H-E-G-M combination too often. And apothem is a short and pithy saying. And it's very similar to an aphorism. And I like to think of it as a fortune cookie word. If you've ever bitten into a fortune cookie, and uh, perhaps eaten it, but you'll notice that there's a piece of paper in there, and written on there's a short saying, and that is a maxim, an aphorism, or this more obscure word, which is apothem. And adjective-wise, apothegmatic would be the adjective form of apothem. So that was a word on a words, very few words. Now we have words that are negative in meaning. Pejorative is definitely a high-frequency GRE word, and it means having a negative connotation. That is a word or a phrase that when someone says it, something negative leaps to our mind. So, for instance, to call somebody a garbage man is a pejorative. The word itself is not necessarily has always been that way. We have people who collect our garbage, but over time it's seen or deemed as negative. And so no longer is it this innocuous, oh, there's the garbage man, but it's a pejorative. It has a negative connotation. And we prefer words like, well, trash collector, sort of pejorative as well, but sanitation worker. So any tone, any label or description that has a negative ring to it is pejorative. Finally, we have bromide. I like this because it's one of those words that people think, ooh, it's high school chemistry all over again. But it's actually not. Second definition of Bromide means a trite saying, a trite expression or thought, something that doesn't actually add much. So, for instance, I was feeling sick a couple weeks ago. I think my nose is still bummed up. And, of course, if you tell someone you're sick, they offer the usual bromide, oh, get well soon, or perhaps it's going around, one of those. And, again, it's not going to help you that someone says that. Of course, it's nice of them, but, again, it's a saying that really offers a little help, sort of a generic canned expression. And there we have our words on words. Don't forget to check us out at gre.magoosh.com, and I will see you guys next week.